हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी क्लास थ्री आई एम ओलम्पियाड नंबर सेंस बिफोर दैट लेट्स रिकैप टू थ्री डिजिट नंबर्स लेट्स स्टार्ट विद दिस दिस वन इज एटी नाइन फिफ्टी सिक्स एट हंड्रेड नाइंटी नाइन सिक्स हंड्रेड सेवेंटी नाइन दीज आर सम कॉमन मिस्टेक विच वी नॉर्मली डू वाइल राइटिंग नंबर्स सो कैन यू गेस विच वन इज करेक्ट एंड विच वन इज रॉन्ग थिंक अ वाइल द फर्स्ट कॉलम इज रॉन्ग The correct ones are fourteen, thirteen, eighteen, nineteen, ninety. So let's start with expanded form of four digit. This box has thousand balls. So one such box is one thousand. So next is hundred balls. This square shows one hundred. Next one is. Row of thirty balls. We have three such rows. After that, four unique balls. Let's find the number. Four ones, three tens means thirty. Hundred means one hundred. And thousand means one thousand. So number becomes one one. Three four. That is one thousand one hundred thirty four. This is the number name. And thousand plus hundred plus thirty plus four is expanded form. Is it little bit difficult? Let's try with one more example. Here we have. One thousand box, three tens, and four ones. So, can you guess the number? Four ones, three tens is thirty. Zero hundred. Write zero in hundreds place as there is no hundreds. Then one box of thousand. So number becomes one zero three four. That is one thousand thirty four. Let's begin with number names. For the number five two nine eight, we have eight ones, nine tens, two hundreds, and five thousands, which is five thousand two hundred ninety eight. So number name becomes five thousand two hundred and ninety-eight. Let's try with one more example. Here we have seven ones, zero tens, two hundreds, and three thousands, which becomes three thousand two hundred zero seven is three thousand two hundred and seven. Isn't it simple? So let's check with face value and place value. We have five four three two on the screen. So let's check for face value and place value. Face value will be same as the digit. For five, it's a five. Place value will be five into thousand. That is five thousand. As five is at thousands place, we have to multiply five with the thousand. For four, face value is four, and place value is four hundred. For three, face value is three, and place value is thirty. And for two, face value is two, and place value is two. For the next example, for eight, eight, eight thousand, one, one hundred. Nine, ninety, five, five. So just remember, 
face value will always be same. It will not change as per the place. But place value may differ as per the position. So let's check odd number and even number. So let's try with simple example. Here you can see many apples in the tables. From 1 to 10. I am going to color the boxes that are in pair. Like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So the colored ones are even numbers. And rest are odd numbers. Like 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. There is a simple rule. Even numbers can make pairs. And odd numbers cannot make pair. Numbers corresponding to colored boxes are even numbers. Let's try with the actual numbers. Even numbers always have 2, 4, 6, 8 or 0 on units place. And same way odd numbers have 1, 3, 5, 7 or 9 on units place. And as seen earlier, even numbers can be put into pairs and odd numbers cannot be put into pairs. Let's do one exercise. We have some numbers. Let's put them in odd or even numbers. So first one is 23. It has 3 at units place so it's a odd number. 56 it has 6 at units place so it's a even number. 120 has 0 at units place so it's a even number. 19 has 9 at units place so it's a odd number. 465 has 5 at units place so it's a odd number. 918 has 8 at units place so it's a even number. Great. So let's understand the ordinal numbers. It tells the position of an object in a collection. For example, first, second, third. In this picture, you can see a running race is going on. Boy in a green shirt is at the first position. The girl in the blue shirt is at the second position. And so on. Next one is comparing the numbers with different number of digits. So we have 47 and 128. 47 is a 2 digit number and 128 is 3 digit number. Here number with more digits will be greater than number with less digit. So 128 is greater than 47. Next is same number of digit. So now we have 135 and 163. Both are 3 digit numbers. First check the digits in 100's place. If they are same then check for the 10's place. And if 10's place is same then check for 1's place. So in this example number at 100's place is same. 10's place of 135 is 3, 10's place of 163 is 6. As 6 is greater than 3, 135 is less than 163. Last topic is ascending order and descending order. For ascending order, we should write the smallest number first, then the greater one. Let's try with the example. On screen, we have some numbers. Let's arrange them in ascending order. So the smallest one is 12. So it will come first. After 12, the smallest number is 25. Next, 25. Then 47. 55. 76. Next one is descending order. 
It's completely opposite to the ascending order. Here we write numbers from greatest to smallest. Let's try. First number will be 76. Then 55, 47, 25 and the last is 12. Here we have arranged number in ascending order and descending order. These are the basic concept of numbers. To solve the practice questions of IMO on this chapter number sense, you will find the link in the description for the video. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. Have a nice time.